Hey YouTube, uh, this is a follow-up video to my previous one on how to disassemble uh, your M40 or M40A1. So in this video, I will show you how to put everything back together. Right, let's get started. So, uh, what I'm going to start with is the head harness. And it's the same process for each uh, one of these uh, buckles. I'm going to only do it on one to save myself time. So basically, you're going to feed this little what I call the door in the previous one. Uh, you're gonna put this up and then slide the strap in and then pull the door down and repeat this step. Then there you go. Easy as that. Put this in the forward position. Right, and next I'm gonna go to put the side voice meter on. So we're gonna start with the rubber gasket. This one always goes first. Make sure it sits flush to the mask. And then you're gonna get the voice meter itself. Make sure it's in this position uh, or else it won't seal. So this one goes on the top. Next you're gonna get your ring. Tighten it with your hand first. And then to ensure that it is tightly in there, you're going to get your mask carrier, uh, like the way I showed you in the first video. You're going to get the D-ring. This time, you're going to tighten it instead of loosening it. There you go. We put that away. And then next, let's work on the exhale valve. Right, so what you're going to do is you're going to get this uh, exhale valve. And then you're going to get this rubber stick. Feed it through that little hole hold it there get your hand on the inside of the mask uh, pull the chin cup up and the oral nasal cup then you're going to feel for that little rubber stick i guess then you're going to pull very slowly and gently until you hear this click that one and you can let it go and next we're going to put on the exhale valve cover so how to do this, you're going to do this first. Make sure it is over. And then you're going to, what I do is I pull it to the side and then push it back and then get these around those two upper prongs. Oops, my bad. That's one. Same process for this one. You're going to pull it back first and then so you see that, how it went by itself? Then you're going to pull this one back. And there you go, it's in there. And next, we're going to put the drinking tube into its holder. Put that there. And you click this into place. And then what next? All right, let's work on the tissue tube valves. You're going to get this again. This may be a little tricky because the hole is much smaller and you can't really get your hand in the mask. You're going to feed it through the hole, same process as the exhale valve. One second. There we go. Then you're going to pull up again very slowly until you hear that click. And here we go again. And then pull gently. There you go. And the is, that is the Tissot valves. Right, next, we're gonna put on the drinking tube. Okay, so this might take a little bit of practice. But basically, this is where the drinking tube attaches to. Can you see that? It's that little thing. What you're gonna do is kind of like uh, stretch it over, I guess. So pull this back. You're gonna stretch it over and then push it down. Kind of like wiggling it a little bit. And then now it's there, but uh, if you want to actually drink, you got to put it, you got to move it to the front of the mask. So it's like that. So when you sit, uh, when you put this mask on, it's going to sit right there and then feed right into your mouth. And there you go. You got water. Next, we want to put the inhale valve assembly. Right, so this part, so on the inside. Pull this oral nasal cup back, 
I'm going to put it in, get it into place. You're going to put this little prong, uh, you're going to do that last. But basically, you want to put your finger in, then you're going to push this up gently and pull it also gently because you don't want to break that. Hard to get replacement parts for the M40 unless you buy an entirely new mask. You pull that up. And then you're going to push it down, make sure it sits flush. There you go. And then when you're sure everything is flat on there, you're going to go back in, push this down. And then there's two prongs. There's one over here and one down there, but I can't really get that. So sorry about that. And then you're going to get this, pull it over, and then get the prong over the rubber. I'm pretty sure that's in. Yep, that's in. Make sure where it's supposed to be. And there you go. Most of, yeah, that is the actual mask and everything in it assembled. And if you want to put the outserts on, here I have the neutral gray outserts. What you're going to do is get the corresponding one. And you, what I do is I put it on the lens itself and then hold it down while you flip the apron over the lenses. Oop, my bad. Let me restart over. There you go. And that's how you get the outserts on. And next we have the second skin. We put this inside out. Or under over my bed. Okay, so this I may not be able to show on camera. Uh, it takes a little bit of time. But to put on the second skin, uh, you start from the exhale valve and you work your way up. Uh, instead of like, you know, the way you take it off, you go uh, start from the top and go downward. We're going to take out the exhale valve cover. All right, exhale valve cover. Okay, this is a little bit tricky. Um, what you want to do is get the drinking tube, put it into the bottom hole, and then you want to stretch it. Hold on, why is this so hard now? Right, you want to stretch it over the exhale valve assembly. Okay, and now you got it over the exhale valve assembly. Now you gotta do all these parts. Um, what to do next? I go over the side voice meter. Uh, the second, sk second skin is actually gonna go under the voice meter this time. And then what I do is go to the left lens and you fit it around again. It's mainly self-explanatory. And don't be afraid to overstretch this or break it, um, but just be a little bit cautious because uh, yeah, you want to break it. But it's very stretchy. Uh, as many times I've done it, it's very stretchy. Now we want to get over the front voice meter, or maybe we should get over the right lens, my bad. So same process here. Try not to rush it, but I'm making a video. And there you go. Uh, so far we have it over the exhale valve assembly, side voice meter, and two lenses. Now we want to get it over the front voice meter. And it should be under it, I think, now. Hold on one second. Yeah, it should be under it now. And then for the inhale valve assembly, it doesn't go under anything. It just sits over there. So it may not be perfect uh, where you can see the, the silicone. And, well, there you go. Oh, after I put this back on. Uh, but I showed you how to do that already. And there you go. That's how you put everything back on to your M40 or M40A1 mask. And, yeah, that's everything. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you learned something new. 
and thank you very much.